We're going to look at how do we build and create molecules, starting with a monomer and creating a polymer. Monomer being a single unit. Well, a polymer is a large molecule made up of repeated units. So basically, what we're saying is, how do we get from here to here? How do we get from here to here? We know your body makes large polymers by joining together monomers. Well, here we are breaking apart. These processes have names. This is called a condensation reaction. Well, this is called hydrolysis. You are expected to know those names. They will be how this stuff is approached in questions and exams. We need to look at each one. Let's invent two molecules. Let's keep this really simple and call it molecule A and molecule B. Here we go, chemistry without chemicals. It's a hydrocarbon, so it's surrounded by hydrogens, occasionally hydroxide groups. An enzyme comes along and cuts the stuff out. Removing an H and an O and an H gives us water. We've got our molecule A, molecule B, the bond. We can't have these bonds that don't match up. These join together. So basically, a condensation reaction is where an enzyme chops out the parts of water. So we end up with water left over to create a larger molecule. To look at this another way, the molecules chopped out form water. The bonds that are left over here and here join together, joining the molecule together. This is called a condensation reaction because just like condensation on a mirror in a bathroom, it's creating excess water. The opposite of this would be hydrolysis, water splitting. Let's invent a large molecule this time. In order to split this molecule up, we need to have an enzyme break it up and then add something to these two spots because we can't have single bonds. And in exactly the reverse of condensation, a water molecule is broken up and these bits attached onto the ends. So we end up with, this is called a hydrolysis reaction, hydro for water, lysis for splitting, water splitting. The letters in the boxes can be replaced by anything, an amino acid, a lipid, a glucose molecule anything at all that is a monomer. These reactions are super important as they're the only way that your body can create and destroy large molecules, whether it's digesting food or whether it is building up muscle. Now there is one special case you need to know. As we know, IB loves to mess with special cases. That is when two amino acids join to form a polypeptide. That is when amino acids join to form a polypeptide. If we say here's amino acid 1, this is amino acid 2. These go through exactly the same process of breaking off an H and an OH to join, but you get a slightly strange bond forming like this. You expect it to recognize that bond is a peptide bond. To break it up, you're simply going to add water into here so that you get two smaller molecules.